was raised in a town called Homer, Alaska, and it's actually the farthest west you can drive. It's the end of the road. So anything west beyond that has to do with kind of the airplanes in Alaska are just far away. Uh, either all the remote villages in Arizona have to go away and get there. Alaska is a land of extreme. In the north, the sun sets in mid November and doesn't reappear for more than two months. So we are working in the dark and they come home in the dark. But we have tried to learn from other modern places and we have lighted the trails and have nothing.
50 miles long, the Iditarod commemorates the crucial role in the slave dog play in the settlements of Iowa. Well, you look at the Iditarod nowadays, it's a Super Bowl of Alaska. There are 16 dogs that are harnessed in the Iditarod Trail sled dog race, and they carry a much of a sled. These canine athletes are extremely powerful. They can pull up to 1,200 pounds. This team can run six-minute miles all day long. A far more important, but less well-known event for almost a labor last in soil during World War II was the In the early June of 1942, a Japanese plane scraped the military base at Dutch Harbor in the Aleutian Islands, and on that very same day, Japanese forces occupied Attu and Kiska, which was at the far end of the Aleutian chain. This was the first time since the War of 1812 in which foreign forces had actually taken over U.S. soil. That we were there for about a year, and a uh, major offensive uh, in the fog, and uh, bad weather. Drove them off the island, uh, large box supplies from both sides. More than 2,300 Japanese soldiers were killed along with 549 Americans. The engagement known as the Forgotten Campaign. Alaska was Lord, the make more later.